Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a what's in my vanity. I have this set up right now and I really like it. I have some new additions for like organization and like electronics and stuff like that. So I thought I would share with you guys. Also, I think I'm planning on changing my setup pretty soon. So I thought I would share with you guys what my setup is right now because I do really like it, but it's just a little too small for filming and doing makeup. If this was my vanity for just doing makeup, it would be completely fine. But because filming, I need lots of space in front of me and I don't have it with this little baby vanity desk. <laughs> So I'm thinking of changing it up. But yeah, I thought I would just show you guys what I have for my setup right now. But if you guys are excited and want to see what's in my vanity, then just keep watching. Okay, so, oh, hello. <laughs> so on the right side of my vanity, I have my brushes. So in the center, I have this anthropology cup that I got for my birthday. And then I have my eyeshadow brushes in here. So these two are some new additions to my vanity. I got these at Winners a couple days ago. They have like a marble base and then just gold accents. And I love that you can see the stems. I have my foundation brushes and my oval brushes. And then on this side, I have powder brushes and then including like under eye brushes and just like big fluffy brushes and stuff like that. I just have this from Bed Bath & Beyond and I got it for my birthday and then it just has a light there. Um, I have my Chanel cream bronzer that I use almost every single day and it's just pretty to look at so I like having that on top of my vanity. And then on the left side of my vanity I have another set of brushes. These are all my bronzer, contour, and blush brushes. And then next to it I have some lip liners which I probably should try and use lip liners a little bit more. Um, in the back I just, this is a recent addition, I got a little TV that hooks up with an HDMI cord to my camera. So this is now a big monitor. So pretty much a big viewfinder for my camera when I'm filming. So I'm so excited I can finally film with no glasses on and not be blind. So, and then in front I have this little acrylic piece that I got from Winners. I believe I got it on sale for like six bucks. But I kind of like to have my go-to products that either I want to try out a bit more or my everyday products. So on this side I have more foundations and concealers. I have this unique foundation that I kind of just want to try out a bit more. I was thinking about doing a video about it. My Marc Jacobs foundation just because it's pretty to look at. Some body shop stuff. Um, some concealers. If you guys haven't seen my recent video of these two comparing them, I will link them down below. And then I have this Makeup Geek lipstick that I've been obsessed with. I got it in my BoxyCharm and I use it every single day because it is the perfect shade. In the middle section, I have some lip products. I have my Stila glitter eyeshadows, my Fenty red lipstick, my MAC lipsticks, which are like kind of like everyday colors, and my Versali oil. On the far left side, I have my IMV Lash Serum, and this has been working so good. Oh my god, I've been using it consistently for about a month now, and my eyelashes have grown so much. Before they were so pathetic, and now they curl and they're so long. And then I have my Charlotte Tilsbury, uh, what is this called? airbrush flawless finish powder. I have my favorite bronzer right now, the NYC bronzer. And then I just got this one. This is the Master Chrome Highlighter in Molten Rose Gold. I, it's so pretty. I'm wearing that one today. And then on this side, I have my highlighting brushes. This one used to be my go-to highlighting brush, the Morphe M510. But this one is the one I've been using most recently now. This is the M438. And then in this little shot glass, I have kind of like smaller brushes. They would just get lost in my other makeup brushes. So just little ones, like little foundation brushes. So in the front drawer of my vanity, I have these little dividers. I got these from HomeSense and then this little skinny one's just from the dollar store. So on this far left side, I have my beauty blenders. I have my beauty blender, the L'Oreal Beauty Sponge, Real Techniques, um, another little Real Techniques one, and the Morphe Sponge. Back here, I have my Duo Lash Glue and then just some hair clips just to pin back my hair. 
I have the Lush Bubblegum Lip Scrub that I am obsessed with. It's so good and it's so tasty. Um, and then in this front one, I have some Lip Chap, a little Sila liner, and then a little Benefit highlighter. And then in this middle section, I have like my go-to tubes pretty much. So I have a waterproof mascara, my bottom lash mascara, just like another little regular mascara that's not waterproof. And then I have my Hoola Quickie Contour Stick, a tinted brow gel, a regular brow gel, and a eyebrow pencil. This is the NYX Micro Brow Pencil. On this right side, I have a just a little powder sponge. Um, I have my Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder, my Lash Curler, the Hourglass Vanish Stick Foundation, uh, my favorite MAC blush in Ginger Lee. This is the MAC Studio Fix Powder in NC40. This is the Wet n Wild bronzer, I think. It's kind of just like a shimmery bronzer. I got this in the States and I just put it in my vanity just to try out a little bit more. And then this is my Becca highlighter in Champagne Pop. It actually cracked, but I kind of put some alcohol in it to like smash it back together. So hopefully it holds up a little bit longer. So all the products in my front drawer are kind of just like my go-to products for every day. When I'm filming, I go out into my Alex drawers and pull out the products that I'm going to be using. But otherwise, these are my go-to everyday products. So this is the door on the left-hand side. So on the door, I have just some like command strips with some headbands and then my scissors. In the front, I just have a little bit more of these organizers. In the back, I have my setting sprays. For my setting sprays, I have my all-nighter, Maybelline, L'Oreal, NYX, Essence, um, Wet n Wild, and my Tarte Rainforest of the Sea. In the back, I have cleaning supplies. So I have some Real Techniques shampoo, as well as my Cinema Secrets brush cleaner. The Cinema Secrets I like way better. It cleans it so fast. So underneath the tray, I have all my false lashes. Um, on top here, I just have a candle lid just so I can mix stuff on top of it. Like if I want to mix foundations. I have this old Tarte kind of like makeup palette. I love the bronzer in this. I used to use this all the time. So I pulled it out just so I could use it a little bit more. And then I recently just bought these off Amazon. These are the Ardell Demi Wispy lashes and it was like 11 bucks so that was a really good deal so here i just have like this mac card that i found my face with after i use setting spray here is just the tin that came with cinema secrets to wash your brushes with here i have some go-to foundations right now that are my shades so urban decay maybelline this is their new super stay foundation clinique um bourgeois paris and the body shop so i just kind of have these sitting on the side and then in the front i have my smashbox primer water fenty foundation fenty primer some q-tips and then this has just had some like foundation that broke so i have that in there and then as you can see i have my monitor and then i have my ring light and my tripod normally sits right behind where the camera peeks in right there so that's my video guys, thank you for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what's in my vanity. So as you can tell, not a lot of makeup storage for what I have at my fingertips. I would like a little bit more. I thought I would share with you guys what I have for my setup right now because I do like it and I think eventually I might come back to this. Stay tuned for a video coming up of me possibly changing around this room again. Um, I kind of want to have just like a bigger setup for makeup and filming. If you guys liked seeing what's in my vanity, make sure you give it a big thumbs up and comment down below if you guys want. Also, if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe to this channel. The big red button is down below and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!